Now, from your weather authority, meteorologist Stacy May. Well, we have stayed quiet and dry all weekend long. We have been thankful for that. And we've been warming our temperatures up. And we are going to keep both of those trends going for our Monday. But then we have some pretty big changes coming with our temperatures. So I'll show you that in just a moment. First, let's look at live first morning Doppler radar. It is quiet, getting a much needed break uh, from the active weather that we had last week. And we're going to keep it dry and quiet for tonight and also for the next few days. So here's a look at our rainfall over the next three days. And normally pull this graphic out and show it to you to show you some rain that's on the way. But really wanted to show it to you because, again, we're happy that we're going to stay quiet and dry for a little while longer. Tomorrow looks dry. Tuesday looks dry. And Wednesday, for the most part, right now does look dry. We'll watch for some showers that will get close to our western and southern counties. And we'll have to keep an eye on that. But right now, it looks like it'll just miss us on Wednesday. Then we'll pick up our rain chances on Thursday. That's a look in downtown Evansville, our Superior Ag Tower Cam from the top of the Fifth Third Bank building. Just a few mid to high level clouds out there this evening and the temperature has dropped into the 50s, but it's been kind of holding steady in the 50s uh, for a little while now. We're at 55 and the wind is calm. And we'll fall a little bit more tonight, but we are not going to get nearly as chilly as we did last night when we went down to that low of 36. So we're all kind of slowly falling through the 50s right now. And a few of you have dipped into the upper 40s. Vincennes is at 49. Carmi, you guys are down to 48. You were in the upper 40s in Greenville last hour, but you've come up to 50 now. And I think upper 40s to low 50s is where we will kind of level off tonight for overnight lows. That's where you'll start your Monday. Storm tracker not showing too much. Again, just some of these batches of mid to high level clouds kind of streaming in from the west. That should be about all we see for tonight and tomorrow too. So we're going to have another good looking day tomorrow. And here it is on future trackers. Skies stay mainly clear to partly cloudy overnight and into your Monday morning. So a good deal of sunshine tomorrow. Few of those clouds kind of moving through, mixing in at times. Now, it is going to get windy tomorrow. Nothing like what we had on Friday, but a windy and even warmer day. So enjoy your Monday afternoon. We are going to top 70 degrees across the tri-state tomorrow, and that is going to be our warmest day for the next seven, probably uh, for the foreseeable future. So again, take advantage of it tomorrow. Then partly cloudy skies again tomorrow night. We will have a cold front coming through tomorrow night into Tuesday morning. Morning. For the most part, it just brings an increase in the clouds for us. A couple models spit out a few sprinkles, but nothing more than that. But we are going to feel the difference on Tuesday. That's when some much cooler air comes in and kind of takes us back to normal. So for the rest of tonight, mainly clear. Not as chilly as last night, upper 40s to low 50s. And then tomorrow, just a beautiful Monday, sunshine, some clouds mixing in. It's going to be windy. It's going to be warmer. 70 to 75, the high tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow night, that cold front comes through, brings us some clouds, a little chillier Tuesday, 41 the low, but then much cooler in the afternoon. And again, that's normal. But compared to that 73, that's going to be a little tough to take on Tuesday afternoon. But we'll stay dry and have a partly cloudy sky. More clouds than sun Wednesday and chillier Wednesday and Thursday. Maybe a struggle to get up to 50 for a high. Again, Wednesday looks mainly dry. And then our best chance, the way it looks right now, for scattered showers will be the second half of Thursday and Thursday night. Drier, a touch warmer Friday, but then the chillier air kind of settles in again over the weekend. Highs near 50 and maybe some rain on Sunday. Cody? All right. Thank you, Stacy. Well, still to come, it is Evansville Burger Week. We tell you where you can grab some grub to celebrate next.